The Touring Car Series in Forza Motorsport can provide really fun racing. And that's what I want to show you today. This race happened on a recent livestream. It starts off really well in the Peugeot 308, but I get distracted by reading chat, as you will see. Don't text and drive, I guess. If you are new to the channel or haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. It really helps more than you know. But I'll now leave you with past HD from the live stream and really hope that you enjoy this one. Good start. Not quite sure if I wanna take the full outside line or if I maybe should cover the inside here. I think I'm gonna do something in the middle. Just taking it a little bit easy here. I think there's someone beside me. So I need to be a little bit careful. Managed to clear him. So eight lap race, so I guess we're gonna do just simple four lapper and then see what the tires are like if we need to pit right away. Oh boy. Hey Petty, welcome to the stream. Oh boy, I shouldn't reach that while driving. Look what you did. <laughs> really surprised I managed to catch that. Didn't expect that. But we are still in this race. We have someone beside, I think. This curb. Bad exit. <laughs> yeah, no worries. It happens. I probably just shouldn't reach it unless I'm on a straight. Give him a little bit of space on the inside. It was maybe a little bit too much. Oh well. I guess this makes it more inst interesting anyway. So we have some potential fighting ahead here. Slow down a little bit earlier there. So I want to send it here if they are fighting. break a little bit earlier for this one than I do. Take that into account. Nice driving from these two in front so far. 
Also, there's someone else catching up in... Yeah, it's an MG. So he will be passed on the straights. I think this might be really hard to get an opportunity for an overtake here. What are the tires doing? I don't think going to the pits early is really an option here. I think I could hit right now because five laps on mediums in this car that might get really hairy in the last one so uh, just stick to it and hit at the end of this lap. Luckily they are still fighting in front, so I can keep up here. And then sideways. Can I get on this inside? Can. Oh boy, still there. Close racing though with the top four here. It's fun. I'm falling behind a little bit. Everyone's gonna go to the pits now. Oh, I did get a penalty for that. Okay. We don't have to slow down for this one, I don't think. Not quite sure what was going on there. Uh, messy start for you. Ah, that sucks. Always seems to happen, or a lot of the time, in the midfield. Yeah, I did get a half a second penalty for that collision into the pit lane. I'm quite sure for this one you can just full send it and the game slows you down. Oh well. to get one place at least, but he's still quite close behind. Oh, the Peugeot in front. Yep. Herbs at Kayalami. Poor guy. Murdered by sand on the curbs. And thanks for the sub, it's very well. A 
little bit faster than this one. MG behind is really pressuring me. Um, advice on best ARB settings. I would urge you to actually check out my tuning guide video. I go into a lot of detail what the ARB settings do. Oh, kind of need to take care a little bit here. Um, because like both the front and rear have different characteristics in terms of what does increase under and oversteer. Oh, that was not nice. Well, it was good overtake from him, but I kind of scooped that up. Yeah, just search for my tuning guide video and go to the section for ARBs. There are timestamps in the video, so you can just check out that section if you want to. Nice move from him, actually. These MGs are quick, at least in a straight line. But depending on their tune and their driving, they might drop off in the last lap. So we might have an opportunity there because of their tire degradation. Should be worse than mine. Our tires should be fine for the last two laps. I think for them, at least in the last one, it might be a little bit more difficult. maybe just bite my time for this lap and then try and attack more in the last one if I can. At least that's the plan right now. that was on me, I'm not quite sure. I think we were side by side. Always so hard to judge in the moment. Felt like he turned into me. I'm not 100% sure on that. I actually just noticed the guy in P1 has a big penalty, 3.35 seconds. So I don't actually need to overtake him, but apparently I can. Goodbye. So I guess it will be between me and Ghetto Tuned. Who doesn't have a penalty while well, I do, so I need to clear him by at least half a second. Well, let's get on it. So far so good. One more.
This is gonna be close. Maybe not. Oh, I can still screw this up. Actually, still managed to do it. Ooh, 